I'm going to airplane. Not wearing already. any makeup because we're natural. Natural. I hate this. You look perfect. No, I don't, Jen. You do. Really broad. I did, however, I did take these out before we started because I was afraid if I had to take them out on camera, it would just be a like slime of yeah. saliva. Yeah. Or, like, I just can't go that far. Look at all these ladies. And Colin, because he always makes it in on the top. Hi, Colin. Yep. He's um, Julie's here. Hi, Julie. Hi, Please. everybody. Hi, ladies. You guys, this is a big night. First of all, let's toast as we normally do. Jen is very uncomfortable right now, but looks like I a know. million bucks. Hide behind this. To all of our essential workers, to all of our ladies, to all of our nurses, doctors, delivery guys, truck drivers. All the people that bring packages to our door that make life better, we yes. cheer to you. My Amazon guy is such a hero. Honestly, I'm not going to lie. We've got, we have a lovely regular mailman, but I don't know if maybe he's taken a little time off. So they've sent this sub mm -hmm. mailman and he, he is not unattractive. Okay, I to begin with Kristen has a mailman thing. I want to get to this. I got to get to this. <laughs> she doesn't have eyebrows on. I can't stand it. Like one of these is just doing their own thing all the time. I got to even them out. I hate it. I don't even know what you're talking about. The whole world is like, what do you mean you don't have makeup on? You look fantastic. Okay, but tonight's episode, if you will, is that what we're calling it now? An episode? I don't know. You guys always ask about Jen's skin and it always looks perfect even up close, I'm telling you. And she's going to give some of her little beauty secrets away. And I figured I've got a lot to learn myself. So I'm going to go along yeah. for the ride. Well, I have to make this disclaimer, okay? Kristen always wants me to do this. And I never want to do this. I have to wear a lot of makeup. Like I had cystic acne, like for like I was on serious medication for it. So I, I cannot leave the house without makeup. Kristen can leave without, like she can go to like, a red carpet event and just put on lipstick that's, and he looks first like, of all that's awesome that's awesome that you would even think i i get to go to red carpet events because unless it's literally like a red carpet at somebody's tacky house i don't get invited and second of all uh everybody just comes up to me and always goes are you really tired are you tired when i don't wear makeup so we all have our things we all have our things hold on elizabeth green says um she just watched our amazon comedy special well if it's one thing we have a lot on in that special, it's makeup. So much and too much on my legs. Glorious. I was trying to look tan. Whatever. You live, you learn. No, you are still so caught up on your legs being too tan. I'm like, look at my awesome leather pants that don't fit my crotch right. This is great. I love those pants. I know. I've worn it. I'm going to wear them 1,000 times. Okay. Somebody just said, don't forget lab techs. And th those people are working like crazy. That's a good oh. one. I'm going to double cheers to you. Plus, yeah, the lab tech. Tech. I mean, all of it. I think there's so many people that are, oh, mm. and a big, yeah. Okay. You want to get started, but I can just give this okay. shout out. And then we can get more. sanitizing because I see this like rosacea. I'm just trying to like. Well, while Jen sets up her tools, just a big shout out to, we don't even need the Where picture. To Netflix because Netflix just funded a hundred and fifty million dollars to all the for relief for film crews. Which, if you live in Los Angeles, yes, the fancy people, the celebrities and stuff is what you think is part of a film crew. But there are so many people that rely on that are doing like craft service, that are grips and electrics, that are like even your PAs, your gaffers, your like wind window cleaners. Like it's an industry that supports a town. So if this were like you know, a plastic making company, everybody would be employed at that company. So Netflix is so baller. They just put down $150 million in relief. And uh, so we're big fans of Netflix. Thank you, Netflix, for doing the right thing. Thank, right. You. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I like their, uh, let me put up the billboard. Did you tell them what it says? Uh, yeah. No, I didn't. I just figured you were going to say you will work in this town again. And when we saw the headline, we didn't even realize it was about like, the entertainment industry i was like oh that's good like give people yeah, we, like, everybody will work again yeah it's but it was about the yeah it's cool coming to move my face 
Can I? I feel so. Oh, wait. Somebody just said, okay, Jen is feeling very uncomfortable. You can tell this is my wheelhouse. I'm like, let's let it ride. Hold on. Kristen uh, Birches, Bircher says, what is the Amazon comedy show? <gasps> we have an Amazon comedy special on Amazon Prime video. If you haven't seen it, um, hell, you're watching everything else. You might as well watch that. It's yeah. We, we, around, we did this tour when we first started doing I Mom So Hard. We did a comedy show at these theaters. We brought our husbands and our kids with us. That was not the smartest yeah but we're working it out with our husbands day by day step by step but then we Amazon came and recorded it and you can watch it on Amazon Prime came and recorded it are you like I then came with the fancy with the camcorder no they were very special lady I'm gonna get my VHS oh, out. Okay, Jen, let's see here. My right here I'm gonna start okay, okay. gonna put I'm my gonna serum on first I do a vitamin C serum and then I love this Kiehl's. It's like a moisture serum. Kristen, what do you do to moisturize? What's your, uh... oh. Like right before I put on my makeup? And also, listen, nobody's given us money for any of this stuff. This is like how I do this. Because also everybody's like, Jen, why do you do your full face every day? Because it literally takes me five minutes to do it. Otherwise, it would not really good at it. She can do it. I as really do it I have to do a sample. Is that, I could just put that on. Do it. That's what I say about serums is, if they offer that as a free sample, get them because they last forever, like a month or so, because you just need a couple drops. But I'm using this like tanning serum. You put two drops in with everything else, even like your moisturizer, and it makes your skin have a little color to it. But I, you guys, I'm the oiliest human being there's ever been. Like, I, they'll study me someday because I have- Are you still yes. putting stuff on? Look at, hold on. Nightshade, that cannot be a real name. Colin is too cool. He married a hilarious social media hottie and has worked with YouTube royalty. It's Lloyd Alquist. Okay, I was going to say, somebody changed their name, and I thought it was Colin's friend from college. Okay. It's Colin's friend from college. It's also Colin's friend from uh, the West Side Comedy Theater who's watching us right now, who helped Andrew. us set up these uh, webcams and stuff. He's Andrew. not watching. A little bit of eye cream. BT. Oh, wait, that's not from Lloyd. Weird. Who's it from? I don't know. Nightshade. Why? Nightshade. Nightshade is the name of a deadly weed, right? That will kill you, destroy your crops. Deadly nightshade. I love that that guy was at home. Like, what should I name myself? What should my avatar be? It should be like something really intense, like nightshade. It sounds really cool, but if you're from anywhere slightly agricultural, you know it to be a weed. You know it to be a weed. That's right. But you can't smoke, so it's not. Um, that, it's just benefit. Are, are you still putting on stuff before you put on the like actual stuff on your face? Yes, because I uh, am a woman of well, advanced age. Okay, so first I do uh, eye concealer. That's my first step, and then I do a little bit everywhere that I have too much red, which is a lot of places. Not my neck. I'll get to that. I'll get to that. I have sunspots too. Do you have any makeup with you? Yes. <laughs> yes. I okay. have my I have my free my my free with purchase. I my oh. don't put me on the spot. I have my well, under eye cream. Somebody just asked. I keep forgetting to say it's NARS. Oh, it's so good. I need yes. to get some of that. I keep yeah. forgetting. I, this is one of those that I got like sucked because I'm obsessed with concealers. I like read one of those lists of like everybody's favorite blah. And this was like a favorite makeup artist. It's really not pretty much all of this stuff you can buy at Ulta and uh, get points and use your coupons on. So. I will tell you this. I am. I'm not somebody that has a lot of stuff, but the stuff I buy is kind of pricey. But I can also buy when I have to like you know, pull the reins a little bit on my budget. I can also buy everything that I need at CVS. And I'm telling you, I've been like a diehard. I have this one. Oh, we both like this. This has been like one of my favorite eyelash. What do you yeah. call it? Mascara. Same. Mascara forever. This is what every makeup artist uses, by the way. No, I, never head. I never know what we're doing here. Hold on. I'm going to do my, this is one of my secrets. This stuff is my secret. And there's not a product that I do. Okay. Let me put the lid back on. 
because I am so oily skin, this is um, Clinique, it's BB cream. So it's like foundation and it's SPF 40 in one. And this is the acne solutions one because it will mattify you if you're super oily like I am. But they have mattify too. But it's got such good coverage and it's not thick like at all. Won't make you break out. Oh, that looks good. Wait, what is what is mattify? So you don't look oily. See, I use this, Kristen, and I'm still like super. super you are not. You, I think what you have is like glisteny stuff. Like you, you get I you're, put, you're, you're um, glowy. I do put some of that on. The other thing I like about this is it's not that hard to blend, and uh, you get sunscreen on your neck if you use it. But uh, there's lots of room for air, so you don't have to do it right. And I just use like a sponge. Um, Re say the thing the, about the products that we're going to have them listed somewhere because people oh, are curious about what oh, it is okay. you're using. Chris, yeah. Okay. So uh, we're going to post, like we said, none of these were like, uh, we don't have a deal with anybody or anything. These are just the ones that I use. I'm, so saying we wouldn't. I'm not saying that we wouldn't. And I'm not saying you can't send it to me for free stuff. Yeah. But, uh, me. So, on Amazon, we have an I'm Mom So Hard page, so you can go on and search I'm Mom So Hard. You can probably find the special that way too, and the book, and then you'll see like a like a brands that we've recommended or ones that we use that we've mentioned it on something. So, what you have right now, you have the Nars thingy deal, the BB for your whatnot, and then yeah, it's the best. I'm telling you, I I don't really want to do this about that many things because like if a product does me wrong. I will do nothing but bad mouth it. But if a product does me right, if I had a daughter that had even just like pimples or something like that, that was trying to like, wasn't into wearing makeup, this is a sunscreen that's tinted. It just gives you credit. Oh, well done. I swear, it's the best. And then I use my old school uh, Bare Minerals to give me a little bit more evenness. Okay. And it's also got sunscreen in it. Well, I'm getting in on this party, Jen. I'm going to do my, oh, I put glue on my hand. I'm going to get in. I'm going to show you guys how I roll. It's like this. Um, hold on. I use Lancome something that I've had, that I've been using the same one since I was in, I, no, look, look how it's the wrong color. I look like a ghost. No, she doesn't even need to um, look in the mirror. Guarantee you she's not looking right now. She puts it on like <laughs> aftershave. <laughs> this is my <laughs> other quarantine <laughs> tool. This is. Um, you got to put it in the screen, Jen. I can't okay. see. It. I don't even know what that is. I can't. I can't find the screen. It's called. It's Tarte Sketch and Set. So on this end. So many steps. It's an eyebrow like gel. So. You just put it in and it like darkens your eyebrows if they're really light. It also like is like a mousse kind of. Wait, I can't do this without looking. Wait, watch. Okay, so that's mousse for your freaking eyelashes or your, your eyebrows. For those of us who are very Norwegian and then our eyebrows disappear, this darkens them. And then the ones that you have, it lays them like flat. And then the other end. Ready? Yeah. Pencil. So you can go in and add some I'm natural. I'm really excited about this, you guys. This is like her thing. Hold Love on. Eyebrows, you guys. Wow, she does a good job. Here, There's I'm going to show eyebrows. I want to show you guys my quarantine eyebrows because I've been really working on them and I think they're really hot. So hold on. It's just like, here's the thing. If that con, I can't grab that right now. I'm putting on my, my corn eyebrows. Hold on. This is what my core. This is what my eyebrows look like in quarantine, and um, I think it's like really attractive. If you didn't talk, this is what would happen. <laughs> hey, you guys. I'm, uh, <laughs> I have a serious question. Does it? Wait a second. Is that my eyebrow pencil? No. Nope. I'm missing mine like that. Is it really? I don't know, Jen. Move on. Move on. You found a new one. All right. right. And now right. everybody's Close like, off. it's so many steps. It's not it's, that many steps. You're just not that many. So here's the oh, next one that I do. 
I do. Everybody should be putting sunscreen on, by the way. So if it's got a little bit of like color to it, uh, then you're just winning with that. And then I do eyebrows. But then my next step is lipstick. So if that's all I get done during the day. I do. I like doing lipstick too. Hold on. I've got a really good lipstick. Hold on. I'm just going to. what? I, so I should make it a little bit more of a. More of a pronounced lip is what you're saying. Like really. I do. On. This is Mac Ruby Woo. Okay. So just like. Water room for error, Kristen. Just let yourself flow. Okay. I go outside the line, honestly. Why not? I mean, I like it. I like I like that it's happening. And okay, so that one, Mac Ruby Woo. Let me see. You know what? You still don't look bad. That's what is so irritating. You look well, you look a little scary actually. You look very like get in my van right now. Very get in my van, actually. Ooh. I have nightmares about that. That foundation's way too light for you, by the way. It's like, are you, is that clown makeup? No, but I. That's what I'm really excited about is clown makeup because the the new clown white is like off the charts. It spreads so beautifully. You don't have to hardly have any of it. It it stays. Nobody really cares about that. But okay, this what this is the thing I would say is my other like trick deal that I like always if you want to like look at so this is a another bare minerals this is called pink sky use your same brush go get yourself some sort of a um, highlighter one of these powder palettes it's got like illuminizing blushes bronzers and stuff in it and don't I, you clean your thing your brushes in the deal like you because you don't want it to infect your skin or something you should Didn't clean your brush. Well, I don't know. I didn't clean a brush for like 14 years. I literally like That's wrong. That's kept giving so myself exactly pink eye. Good. So I'm gonna look shiny in this light. But I'm gonna do my eyes real quick. It'll give you like a dewy, like healthy glow. If you don't tan like I do, do it on the outside of your nose, underneath your nose. Dad, what are you doing now? Are you making fun of me? No. I'm just playing along, Jen. Go about your business. See, I have I have a light on though. I have a light on, so Kristen's foundation being too light is not the problem here. <laughs> oh man. Oh, yeah. I like bare minerals loose too, but I kind of like go back and forth depending. And then uh so I always do mascara on my lower lashes because I generally have some sort of a False eyelash on my. <laughs> I like to wear. I my big thing is mascara as well. I just want it to seem subtle and natural. You know what? That's what's happening right here. I feel like I'm watching like a drag thing. Like <laughs> there's a big ball of glue. I'm really worried it's gonna go in your eye. Oh, it will. But for a you know, laugh, I'll do anything. It's fine. It's fine. You guys, I honestly kind of feel attractive with this one eyebrow. Is that because I'm digging into like my natural self? Jen, you look so pretty. I do. That's sweet yes. of you to say. All well, right. I'm not going to talk up your butt. I'm not going to or my eyeshadow. And I did. I I'm not one of those people that does it first. I know you should, so you, like you can correct it. I do a base all over. Very easy. Honestly, you can do this all in like five minutes. I'm not joking. Kristen was like, don't do it in five minutes because then you can't like, follow it. We all know mine would take 14 seconds and I would just do the left side of my face. But this is the best trick and I learned it from a makeup artist when I was working in makeup a long time ago. So for your like corner of your eye, get like sort of a loose long brush and just do circles and keep like reapplying it till it gets to the color, like the, or the, the depth that you want it to be. And if you do little circles, you don't even have to worry about the shape of it because it'll like do little circles, Kristen, little circles. All the ladies like the little circles. 
little, and then you can uh, you can use like a medium color to like smooth it out to like blend it in. Like okay. a medium. I'm really smoothing it. I'm feeling like really good. I'm gonna smooth it. You want a little bit more drama? You, this is a um, this is an eyeshadow. This one is expensive. My mom bought it for me. It's Laura Mercier, and it's a crayon. But oh, I, I've, I've heard of those crayons. The Kardashians say make a number three on your face. Make a number three. Make a number three on your face. I do a lighter right there. And then I do my liquid liner. And then I've got a dramatic eye. So it really doesn't take that long. I'm feeling really any, good about it. Any kind of liquid liner that anybody wants or that I got free. Well, that looks good, Jen. Does that look good? Yeah, it looks really good. Thanks. Voila. Yay, you did it. You did it so well. Thanks. It's not that Couple questions for you. Okay. Jessica says, how many brushes do you own? That's a fair question. She didn't ask me, that's weird. Well, I have a lot, but I probably only use a couple that often um i have like this i don't even know if this is a foundation brush but it's what i like for because like I, I should do, yeah i should do like a setting powder or something because i'm a little shiny right now but i have this one and then if you can find like a contouring or this is a contouring brush but i like it for um blush too just because mm -hmm. Uh, and then I, you just have to get like two favorite. You need a really big base, and then That's what she said, <laughs> "Really, I prefer a big base, honestly. You can't have too big." Uh, and then the this is like it's just a looser brush to do like the corners and stuff like that. I have a ton, but it's like you kind of have to buy a bunch of sets so you can like pick and choose the one. Even mm -hmm. when I go to like a um, when I go to like a a cosmetic store and you can buy a brush at a time. I'm like, I don't want to pay 30 bucks. And even if you do, it might not be the one you end up using a lot. All right. That's it. That's boring. I need more wine. No, this you look beautiful. Like Hold on. Kristen looks like Lucille Ball and Russian Globo Gym Dodgeballer. <laughs> you do look like that chicken dodgeball. Should I do it too? No, don't move, don't ruin it. No. Right. I want to see what I look like with that. It's it's actually kind of freeing if I'm going to be okay. Everybody at home, connect your eyebrows. Connect your eyebrows. <laughs> it looks a little you can just make them look like brown. It really is. You know what? It's very mommy dearest, is what it is. It's very um Betty Davis. She's got Betty Davis ass. Brows. I can't. This is the most my brows will ever move, you all. This is the most. Get used to it. This is gonna go away. You guys, I don't want to hear a single complaint too about having too much hair in your eyebrows because fashion like goes through these phases, and right now, the more eyebrow, the better. So literally, this is gonna be a trend. This is gonna be a trend. I bet it probably already is. And we're just too old to know what the young kids are doing. Jen, how dare you? <laughs> how dare you? Colin, trying to. Jen, what's the um eyeshadow I stick? Does anybody? Oh, oh yeah, you are crap. How could I forget you? Guys? If you're gonna do an eyeshadow stick, do this one and do this color because it's a really good base. It's caviar stick eye color, vanilla kiss by Laura Mercier. And it's a great base and color. And it's not that shimmery. <laughs> you know what? I, I still don't think you look terrible. Even you doing this. I don't know what you mean, Jen. I'm just trying to like. Highlight my skin and even up. look how my, the lashes. Here's what I'll tell you that I love about fake lashes. In all seriousness, here's a, here's a hack. I shouldn't have put these on. Now I can't talk about anything because I look like a cross-eyed cat. But <laughs> the, but 
<laughs> if you are somebody with heavy lids like me, wearing lashes literally acts as like like a like a handle holding them up. So I'm such a big fan of the lashes that because they kind of make me look more awake. So whenever like when we started doing shows and I we I would kept getting makeup all over my face because I would laugh so much. We got I got eyelash extensions and I was like, this is a gift I will give myself forever. That good sunscreen and good moisturizer, which I make yeah. jokes, but I do use those. That's I just don't wear there. I because I used to work for like a cosmetics company and a sunscreen company. And the thing that I learned like from all the studies is like you will look young forever if you use sunscreen. So you might as well use like a tinted sunscreen that like evens you out. So yeah. I, I will not go outside in the morning until I put on that um, BB cream that's SPF 40. I counter. That's a good one. That's the one I like the most. Of And I wear, you know me, I'm a, I'm outdoors all the time. I have sunscreen all the time. Katie Volk just said, my husband walked by and said, whoa, that lady has big eyebrows. <laughs> Stop checking out my eyebrows, okay? Stop checking them out. Yeah. Part of my heritage. My check, my deep check jeans. Oh, yeah. A lot of people are chiming and saying that they love extensions. Eyelashes even with glass. Listen, some people are really gifted and they have a ton of eyelashes. Like, Kristen's have, are super thick, but th she, they're not all that long, right? Yeah, plus I just got lazy and I didn't want to deal with mascara. And when you put those suckers on, it's like hair extensions. It looks so good. Yeah. So then I got like tricked into them. And now with quarantine, I they're just nubs. But I really like the extensions. I just think they're very expensive and they take a lot of time. And like sometimes they can really screw them up. But I, I mean, I again... I will keep doing it, but I'll complain the whole time. That's kind of who I am as a human. I know. I, I hate the time commitment, but I do, like, I miss having them, how natural they look. But I started using these, like, they're called Lashify. And you they're, like, they come in not the clump kinds. Right. There's, like, five at a time. So you put, like, you put five on your eyes. You well, I'm going to try to. What time are we at? Okay. Um, here's a little hack that I should not show you now because it's sort of pointless, but I do think it's a good hack and I'm going to take off these ugly things that I just put on. So just look past my eyebrows, you guys <laughs> I buy, in a pinch when I can't do the lashify things or whatever, I buy like the cheapest lashes that like CVS, I had a bunch in my drawer, so I had to make them last because we're in quarantine. You cut them in half, right? If you cut them in half, then let me take these off. Ow. They see these look like caterpillars. They're too big. But if you cut them in half and then you put the glue on it, whatever, I'm not going to because I have tons on my lid. You can put the lash in the middle, right? And it looks on your line of your lash on your thing. And see, then, oh, shit, I need more glue. But I don't want to put more glue on. But then it just gives you a little pop of yeah. an eyelash. And it helps. Because here's the truth, y'all. We're in a whole new world. We're going to be Zooming a lot. Yeah. We're going to be um, on seeing yourself in reflection. And I don't know about you, but it doesn't make me feel good if I'm like in the dark and I look like crap. And I think to myself all day, I'm like, is that what I really look like? Although if I did look like this, I would be okay with it. Um, I buy yourself a ring light. I, yeah. Buy yourself a ring light. You'll look better on um, Zooms and stuff. But I... Um, I have to, somebody is asking what serums I use and my, this is, I shouldn't be using this as an oily person, but I really do feel like it works. It's this um, Midnight Recovery Concentrate by Kiehl's and you can get like a tiny little sample bottle and it will last you like six months. And then I use SkinCeuticals CNE Ferulic, which is a pricey one, but I have a friend that works for the company. So she has oh, I she can no, she can no, she can hook us up. It's perfectly fair. <laughs> I feel like I just gave him a shout out, so that's a thing, right? Yeah, I'm too oily to do a whole bunch of like moisturizer and stuff like that. Well, I think we've left the ladies with a lot to think about, and it really just depends on which direction you want to go. Do you want to look like this, or do you want to look like that? Wait. Hold on that because this is an option just did a screenshot because I, <laughs> I need that to be the picture that comes up when you call me now oh which sounds great we got to go back okay we got to go back 
All right, the we'll put these on. You say you say your beauty counter. Okay. I like beauty counter sunscreen. I use Lancome. Uh, freaking nobody really cares what I use. Let's just be honest. I just use a lot of Lancome and a lot of sunscreen, and then I do this to myself. I don't even look like me. What's up? Uh, I use this BB cream that's for acneic skin that is SPF 40 and it's tinted and it works as like a foundation too. Clinique should be sending you all sorts of crap because you love that thing. You go like we're on the road. You'll find a mall just that has a Clinique just for that product. You'll get in your car and go. I love it so much. I don't even care if I get the free gift when I get it. Don't you see that? I love a free gift. I do too, but if I need it, I need I'm it for it. I'm not going to wait around for it. Well, no, but I, I, oh, this is not an ad. This is not an ad. This is not an ad. I, no, it's not, you guys. Not we just like, how are we supposed to talk about this stuff without talking about well, our favorite products? No, I know because people keep asking which ones they are. And look, if well, I don't have that, honestly, I'm not going to tell you about it because certainly. You know what we'll do? We'll, we'll post in the comments. You can, I think Erin's watching and she'll do a, a post for us. And before we go, because we have to jump off, but on Friday, Friday, our happy hour, um, we're going to invite, we're going to bring dates and we're going to pretend like they're different people. Yeah. Bring your quarantine mate. We're going to play games again. I'm going to rock this style on Friday. If everybody's really into it, I'm going to rock this out. I find that my husband is looking at me in a weird way, and I think it's because he feels aroused. You sort of look like MC from Cabaret, which is that, like, strangely androgynous, like, sexy thing. Thank you, Jim. Thank you. If my mom jump, jumped on this right now, she, my mom would go, why does she always have to do stupid shit? Why can't she just wear nice <laughs> Why does she always have to do something like that? Look at that. You look so pretty. Look, everybody's asking, what what do you what cleanser do you use? You don't she doesn't even need to wash it off. How do you no, wash it? I really like my friend gave me some and then I I'm a I'm a convert. Um I really like elastin um cleanser and then there's another one that's a foam and I gotta put it on. I gotta you can get it at Sephora and I forget the name of it and I will post it. That is my that's the my favorite, but Honestly, I just like having my face feel really clean. So I'm not going to, I I mean, I like getting in there with a washcloth and making sure it's perfectly clean. And then I use a very nice moisturizer. Yeah. I use uh, Kiehl's. I'm very into Kiehl's right now. I like Kiehl's a lot. But I like not it. Bad. And because it's They're like. They're every airport. They're what? The thing that's nice about Kiehl's is you can find them in every airport. Yeah, and they also, anything that you can get in Ulta, I feel like you can kind of get a deal on at some point. They're 20% off, and their cleansers, like, come in a shampoo size bottle, like, big back bar size, so you can, like, have it forever, and I'm all about yeah. that. I get why people spend, a, I, I do, I mean, the irony, it, when you look at me, I believe in spending a little bit on product. I do. I'm, I feel like I've got one really nice Tom Ford lipstick that lasted me a full year that's the only one I wear, but that thing was really expensive and a big treat to myself, and I think that's okay. you got to find that thing that makes you feel good and buy it for your dang self, as long as you're not using grocery money. <laughs> Gosh, every time I buy one of those like big boxes of uh, chicken nuggets that I know, the dino nuggets that I know is going to last for like two days, I'm like, ugh. And that's your lipstick. Oh my gosh. So yeah, sad. why can't those kids just make their own food? That's what I ask. Um, Jen, we should probably wrap it up because I, I have glue on my right eye. I know you got to watch that glue, and I'm really worried about it. But leave your, leave your favorite product recommendations in the comments because we'll read oh, them. Yeah. Ladies, go. Oh, wait. Sorry, 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 Jen. Date night. Friday. Friday. Date, date night with our men. We're going to pretend there's other people so that it's more exciting. Date night. We're going to uh, we're gonna play a game. We're going to announce the game tomorrow. But we want you to yeah. join us. Bring your husbands. Let's or make it fun. Not, look, if you're not quarantining with a dude, then lucky you. And just bring yeah. a teammate that you can watch and play the game with with us. If Anybody. you don't want to bring your husband, I will not ask any questions. I get it. <laughs> I get it. I literally have to have him role play just that he's a neighbor or something. So I have somebody different to talk to. 
we're, we're, we've, we've gone full circle and that's okay. Yeah. Maybe right. this um, go make love to your husband with that. Ew. Make Well, whatever. What did he say? Oh, he goes, he asked a question. Somebody says, do you hang out after this? And generally the question is, the answer is yes, we'll get done with this and we keep talking and we forget. But right now my eye is swelling shut because I have glue on my 40 eyelids. <laughs> so I will not be able to hang out tonight, but yes, we always hang out after usually. Uh, I don't usually use the saying make love, but I just thought I'd be creepy because Kristen looks so creepy. creepy. You just brought me back. Yeah. Who says that? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. People that like to be, ah, don't. He's reaching in. You tell everybody what Colin does to you um, at the end of every live when we're getting ready to post it. It's my favorite thing. Just leave them with that image. Kristen's sitting there and he walks in in a speedo. So his drawing is right by her face. And I do this. All right, I'll talk to you later. She goes, oh, Colin, Colin. My mom's like, damn, I wish that were me. <laughs> he never does that for me. He never does that. Well, what's a lady got to do? All right, see you guys Friday at 6. Bye, we love you. Thank you for joining us. We'll see you on Friday. Bye.